Hey everyone, so I want to show another useful tool that can be used in assemblies and that's the replace component command. So let's say you have some fasteners or some other components in an assembly that you need to switch out with an updated part. For instance, maybe this fastener here needs to be replaced with a different one. Well, rather than deleting it and then replacing it with a new one and adding those mates back in, we can use a command called replace component. If you select on the component that you want to replace and you right click down at the bottom, you'll find a command called replace components. So if I select this, I can tell it what component I want to replace and what component I want to replace it with. Let's say we want to replace this fastener with this screw here instead. I can, I can also tell it to change only that specific instance, or if you have multiple instances, you can change all of them at once. Once you click OK, note that Reattach Mates is checked on at the bottom. It's going to ask you what mates you want to replace. So in this case, if we look at this component, it's asking us to replace this coincident mate as well as a concentric mate. So what I want to do is take a look in our assembly here. We'll find the component that it's replacing. And it wants us to pick what face we want to make coincident because the coincident used to be mated. And this is a little preview window with the bottom face here that's going to be coincident with the top face of our gear. So what I want to do is select a similar face on my new replacement part, so this face here. You can see a green check mark comes up indicating that that mate has been successfully replaced. The next one, if we click on this one, tells me it's looking for the face or edge that was used to make it concentric with the hole. So while I have this open, I can still move this replacement part around and I would select, let's say, this cylindrical face as my replacement. Both mates now have a check mark indicating that those mates have been uh, replaced. So if I go ahead and click OK, we can see that we replaced that component. And if we had other instances, those would be replaced as well, which makes it an easy, quick way to replace components with updated versions or new components.